Hi, this is Karthik. In this session, I am going to teach you how to perform a better Google search. In first option, we are going to say is an explicit phrase. Let us say you are looking for the content about the Microsoft Word. Instead, you are just typing Microsoft Word into Google search box. You are likely to be better off searching explicitly for the phrases. Do this simply enclose the search press within the double quotes. Okay, we'll see. If I'm going to search Microsoft Word, yeah, you can able to see this much of results. But if I want to go for the explicit search or specific search, you give within the double quotes and press enter. So now you can able to see the search will be reduced and exert word what you are searching you can get it the Microsoft Word, Microsoft the bold point everything is Microsoft Word. So this is the first search whenever you want to go for explicit phrase or explicit search use double quotes and then go for search you will get the specific answer. Exclude words let us say if you want to search for the content about Microsoft Word but you want to exclude any result that contain the term advertising do this simply using minus sign in front of the word you want to exclude if you want to exclude anything from your search is use minus sign here you are going to be able to see use minus sign Microsoft if you want to eliminate any words use minus advertisement so now you can able to see one day this Microsoft Word will come whenever you are going for advertise it won't come so whenever you want to exclude a word from the search use minus sign so that it can be eliminated and site specific search if you want to search a specific site often you want to search a specific website for the content that matches a certain places even if the site does not support a built-in search feature you can use google to search the site for you your term simply use the site and some website.com modifier if you want to find only the url so what you have to do is site colon give the website name let us say www.pbc.com Yes, you can see only the URL. Yes, you can see only the URLs you can get. So this is for searching a specific site, and before that you want to use site, and then comes your address. And similar word and synonyms. Let us say you want to include a word in your search, but you want to include the result that contain the similar words or synonyms. Do this. Use tilde in front of the word. So whenever you want to find a similar search or like search, use the symbol tilde. So, so use Microsoft Word and tilde. Use professional. So if you use this professional, you can able to see the similar word starts with professional P. You see here everything with similar same meaning will be displayed. So whenever you want to go for the similar word or synonyms use tilde in front of the word. Specific document type. If you want to search for a specific document type if you are looking to find a result that are of specific type you can use a similar modifier that is a file type for example you might want to find only powerpoint presentation related to microsoft word how to do this here is the syntax microsoft word and file type is ppt so here you want to give microsoft word so keyword you should give within the double quotes and then use file type colon ppt Yes, you can able to see only the PPT types can be viewed. All PowerPoint presentation can be viewed. Other files we cannot able to view it. If you want to go for PDF, yes, if you search like this, only PDF document will come. 
if you want to search for DOC document yes only document type will come you can able to see only this type will appear and this or that if you want to use R by default whenever you do a search Google will include all the terms specified in the search if you are looking for any one or one or more terms to match then you can use the OR operator so note OR has to be capitalized so don't use small r r has to be capitalized so similar word this or that search right so how to do this I'm going for word 2007 OR should be in caps or word 2010 so this or that go for search and you can able to see for 2010 or 2007 will come right this this search is called this or that search and phone listing let us say someone calls you on your mobile number that you do not know who is it if all you have is a phone number you can look up it on google using the phone book features As if someone is calling the number you don't know this number then you can search it by using the phone book option right so let us say the syntax is phone book colon so phone book colon and the term let us say some numbers you search it it will display the numbers so this is how we can able to trace the phone numbers if it is anonymous call and area code lookup if all you need to do this is to look up the area code for a phone number just enter the three digit area code the google will tell you where it's from for example 617 if you enter the only the code number it will tell where the area code will be right so this is how we can able to find the area code and numeric ranges this is rarely used but highly useful tip let us say if you want to find a result that contain any of a range of numbers you can do this by using x dot y modifier in case this is hard to read what is between x and y are two periods this types of search is useful for years as shown below the price or any one where you want to provide a series of numbers right so whenever you want to find the values between two numbers between the years you can able to do it for example I want to find out the precedent between the year 2000 and without space dot dot 2013 so you can able to find the precedents who lies between 2000 and 2013 so this is how this is called as year search this is how we can able to perform the year search and stock ticker symbol just enter a valid ticker symbol as your google search term and google will give you the current financial and quick thumbnail chart for this stock so use ticker So this is called as a tickle search where we can able to see the stock. Here the valid tickle symbol you search. Google will give the current financial and quick thumbnail chart for the stock. So this is nothing but financial and quick thumbnail chart for the stock. And calculator. The next time you need to know the quick calculator. Instead of bringing up the calculator applet, you can just type your expression into. For example, if you want to calculate 158 dot one six four into one two five here comes the result so this is the result this is how you can be able to use as a calculator as well as one more term is there if you want to add any keyword to your search let us say microsoft word if you want to include the keyword 2010 yes without sp space include the word 2010 so it will display the result so which is a mandatory 
विच इंक्लूड्स गो फॉर द सर्च एंड हियर यू कैन एबल टू सी वर्ड टू थाउजेंड टेन ऑफिस टू थाउजेंड टेन दी वर्ड टू थाउजेंड टेन विल बी आई लेटर इट मीन्स और इन दिस सर्च दिस इज एडवांटेज और इम्पॉर्टेंट इन दिस सर्च सो दिस और द वेरियस टाइप ऑफ सर्च वी कैन एबल टू परफॉर्म अलॉन्ग विद गूल ग्रोम एंड आई थिंक यू मे एन्जॉय दिस वेडियो थैंक्स फॉर बींग विद दिस थैंक